Sometimes you're asked to calculate the retained earnings for the year. I'm going to show you how to easily calculate that with the following information as an example. There is more to it than just a simple example, so make sure you watch it all the way to the end and I'll give you some additional guidance. But you've come to the right place because I'm Professor Capco and I help students with solving problems like this. So in this case, we're trying to calculate the retained earnings. We want to know the retained earnings for this particular year ending in two. So we look at what the retained earnings are at the end of last year, which would be the year ending in one, is 25,000. The net income for that entire year for this, this year, with the year in, that ends in two, is $10,000. And dividends paid out, is $5,000 and that's dividends paid out this year. So the way we're gonna figure it out is we're gonna look at retained earnings as we got a beginning retained earnings, we're gonna add the net income, we're gonna subtract out any dividends and that's gonna give us our ending retained earnings. So in this case, our beginning retained earnings is the ending retained earnings from last year. So January 1st of this year ending in two, the retained earnings are going to be the same as at the very end of the year, December 31st of the year ending in one. So I'm going to write the $25,000 here. We're going to add to it our net income for the year. Our net income in this case is $10,000. So I'm going to add 10,000. So if we got 25,000 and we add 10,000, that's $35,000. We're going to subtract out the dividends. We're told that the dividends this particular year that are declared and paid are $5,000. So I'm going to subtract out the $5,000 that are dividends. And that leaves us the $35,000 minus $5,000 is $30,000. And that's our ending balance retained earnings for December 31st, 20x2. Sometimes you're given some of this information and sometimes you have to derive it. So I'm going to have some additional videos showing you some advanced techniques to arrive at your ending retained earnings. So make sure you subscribe and keep an eye out for additional videos on this subject matter. Until next time, keep your grade alive and subscribe.